what's up guys welcome back to my channel so this is take two of filming this video um basically i filmed the whole thing and every single clip was out of focus so i changed some settings i am hoping and praying that it works um but yeah so if i keep looking at my camera screen i'm so sorry i'm just really trying to make sure that i can actually film this without um having to do it again so yeah i look a little different my hair i literally just got off work it's like almost 6 p.m um so i'm working with a little bit of light and we're just doing this because i really want to get this up for you guys um the day you're watching this we will be going to magic kingdom for the pass holder preview which is actually in like 12 hours um well a little more than 12 hours but i'm so excited to get it like i'm just so excited so i've been buzzing all day long to try and get this like just to get just to go like i got through my eight hour shift and i was like okay we gotta go we gotta go so anyways um today i'm gonna be showing you guys what is in my disney park bag i figured it would be fitting for this video um that goes up on the day it's going up to show you what i carry with me every day well most times when i'm in the park now this differs depending on what time i'm going what i'm wearing etc but for the most part these are the things i carry in my park bag every single day now they're all kind of laying out on the floor in front of me so it's not going to be as like pulling things out of a bag as it was last time I tried to film this, but let's go ahead and get started. Okay guys, so first things first, I'm gonna be showing you the actual bag that I like to bring to the parks. So let me close it for you really quick. So I bring this bag with me to the parks. This is the Fawn Design uh, mini backpack, I think. It's in a blush pink color and it is actually a diaper bag. Um, Fawn Design is a diaper bag company and they, I saw Aspen Ovard got, get, got one of these for her diaper bag I can't talk got one of these for her diaper bag and for her purse and it is so cute it has like 50 pockets because like I said it's a diaper bag I mean there's zippered pockets back here a attachable pocket back here like everything you could think of is right here so this is what I carry most of the times so at the park unless I'm just going for like a quick like evening um usually I'll just carry a purse but nine times out of ten this is what you'll see me carrying and I love it so much Okay, so now for things that are actually in my park bag. We'll start with just honestly what's laying in front of me. Um, the first thing I see is my wallet. This holds, well, it doesn't have my debit card in it right now, but it holds any kind of like small bits of cash, my license, my permanent residency card, because I have to carry that, a credit card, anything I might need to buy mini ears at the park. No, but I always carry my wallet for literal self-explanatory purposes. Um, the next thing I see is hand sanitizer and Purell wipes. So essentially, this is new. Um, I didn't always used to bring hand sanitizer. I brought Purell wipes sometimes, but this is new. Obviously, um, COVID-19 has rocked our world. This is why I'm going back to Disney World tomorrow for the first time in four months. So I am bringing a full thing of hand sanitizer and some Purell wipes and some alcohol wipes that we just have laying around the house because I wanna make sure I can wipe down surfaces if I feel like I need to, ride handlebars, etc. I know they are clean, but just for my peace of mind. Um, so that's why I'm bringing both of those. The next thing I see in front of me is a mini deodorant and a mini rollerball perfume. Again, I love to smell good, obviously like anybody else. Um, so this is the mini native deodorant in the coconut and vanilla um, shade, uh, shade. <laughs> scent um i love the native deodorant i've been kind of swapping it around with deodorants lately just because i've been trying to try something else so i'm using the dove Do dry spray right now because it's more of an antiperspirant but this is great to just bring with me and you can find these at target and then this is just a random roller ball that i got in like an ipsy bag or something but serves its purpose all right the next thing is another kind of like beauty related thing it's just a hairbrush with a little mirror on the other end again this is not something i always bring but if i ever have my hair down or want to just like touch up for pictures or if i'm out to dinner at disney world um i will bring this with me so i can brush out my hair a little bit or something like that because florida gives me frizz and this can help fix it another item i'm seeing is the disney gift card if you ever need a gift for somebody in your life please give them a disney gift card this has been the best thing because you can just spend it on whatever you want and i obviously always have it with me because why wouldn't i like why would so whenever i want to get something fun or new or cute or just buy a snack i use my disney gift card the next thing is my magic band this is my pink magic band it is a little dirty honestly but i'm so excited to get to put it back on tomorrow um and i also have my little pass holder thingy on it so 
sorry. <laughs> um, so yeah, this is my pass holder band. You know what these look like. Um, I'm so excited to put it back on, but I usually have this one and sometimes I have an extra in my bag, but yeah, I always am carrying this on my wrist or in my bag. The next item is kind of new. Um, it is a water bottle, obviously not this exact water bottle. I just grabbed whichever one was laying around, um, but I really like this water bottle and you have to carry a water bottle in Florida. Like, especially now, I don't know what is gonna be open at the quick service stands or if they're gonna be still giving out free water or anything like that. So I'm gonna bring a water bottle and because you really have to stay hydrated in this Florida heat, it is, if you don't live here or have never visited Florida, like you have no idea, it is brutal sometimes. Like it's so hard. Um, so yeah, water bottles are a necessity. All right guys, the next item is going to be my Polaroid camera. So I got this as a Christmas gift last year and I love it. I think it's super fun and I love to just take quick pictures. Polaroids are so fun to put up around your room and so I always like to carry this also in my Disney bag. Um, another thing obviously I like to keep is a hair tie. Um, I'm wearing a scrunchie right now, which is super fun, but I like to keep just a hair bobble in there so I can throw my hair up in a bun when it does get too hot or if I just need my hair out of my face. And believe me, this happens often. <laughs> um, the next, the next thing is a pair of Disney ears. So either these are on my head or they are in my bag. Um, they fit like pretty well inside the bag. I'd say they fit like sideways, but and everything is pink. Um, but yeah, they fit pretty well inside my bag. I, it depends on what outfit I'm wearing to which ears I'm wearing, but yes, always have Disney ears in my bag because they're the perfect accessory for going to the parks. The next item that is kind of new, well, it is very new, um, that I'm going to start keeping in my Disney bag is an additional face mask. So obviously I wear makeup and I know it's gonna rub off on these masks. So these are actually the Disney brand masks. So I'm gonna keep an extra one or even two in my bag just so I have an extra one in case I get too sweaty, it starts to slide off my face. I wanna switch it up a little. Um, I just want something fresh, you know what I mean? So after being at the parks all day, people have told me that you really just wanna like switch out your mask. Um, so yeah, this is one of them that I have. I have this Disney one. And honestly, catch me doing a mask collection video in the next couple months because I have so many. Cause I have to wear them at work and then we'll have to wear them at Disney and I wear them literally everywhere I go. So that is something that I am also keeping in my Disney bag. Finally, something that is not pictured, two things that are not pictured and also pictured, two things that I'm not showing you and also are not always in my bag is a poncho and an umbrella. So it is definitely hot, like it rains every single afternoon without fail in Florida and we always get soaked at Disney. Like there's no, we know we're gonna get soaked if we go to Disney. Um, so we bought ponchos late last year and I also have an umbrella. Don't always bring the umbrella, but normally we have the ponchos either in my bag or in the car so we can just go and get them if we need them or pull them out if it's gonna rain. Um, so yeah, that is not in this video. I honestly don't know where the ponchos are, so we're gonna have to find them before we go literally tomorrow. But yeah, I am hoping and praying that we can find those. But yeah, that's something else that I actually keep in my bag because you never know when the Florida monsoons are going to hit because they come out of nowhere. All right guys, one final thing that I keep in my Disney bag, and obviously I am filming on it, is my Canon G7X Mark II and its tripod. It does fit pretty well inside my bag, and if it's raining or if I'm going on a water ride, I just shove it in my backpack and it normally stays pretty dry. So I always have that because nine times out of 10, I'm vlogging my Disney trips. Um, I do have a playlist on this channel of all of my Disney videos, a nice little compilation for you, and there will be more to add to that. So definitely check those out, but yes, Canon G7X and Mark II, and my little tripod is something that I always bring, sometimes an extra battery if I feel like I need it. All right guys, that is gonna be it for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed and I hope it interested you a little bit as to what I bring to Disney World and my park bag post COVID-19. Well, not post COVID-19, post Disney being closed. Um, so don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell if you wanna get notified every time I upload a video and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.